Google Glass was a wearable computer developed by Google that resembled a pair of glasses. Google Glass was launched in 2013 and it generated a lot of excitement and hype, particularly in the tech community. However, the product failed to catch on with consumers for several reasons. In this video, we'll look at what Google Glass was and why it failed. Please do subscribe if you haven't already, it really helps this small channel grow. Google Glass was designed to display information in a smartphone-like hands-free format, enabling users to access information and perform tasks using voice commands and gestures. The device had a small prism-like screen located above the user's right eye. This displayed information such as emails, text messages and notifications. It also had a built-in camera allowing users to take photos and record videos. Google Glass could connect to the internet through Wi-Fi or Bluetooth enabling users to access various apps, search the web, and use GPS. Users could control the device using voice commands and gestures, allowing them to access information and perform tasks without needing to use their hands, particularly useful while driving, for example. The device's built-in camera could overlay information onto the real world, providing users with an augmented reality experience. Here's what a user would have seen when wearing the glasses. So that sounds like quite an interesting device, especially for 2013. So why didn't it catch on? One of the main issues was the high price, which was set at $1500 at launch. Very expensive for a device that was essentially an extension of your phone. Additionally, many people found the design to be unattractive and uncomfortable to wear for extended periods. There were also concerns about privacy, as the device could potentially record and take photos without others' knowledge. Overall. While Google Glass failed to gain mainstream adoption, it was a pioneering product that helped pave the way for the development of other wearable technology, such as smartwatches and augmented reality headsets. With rumours of Apple working on one, do you think augmented reality glasses will ever be mainstream and would you buy one? Please do consider subscribing if you've enjoyed this video and thanks for watching.